Hello everyone, this is Kev here from LifeSuccessEngineer.com and I'm super excited to bring you another episode of the Tribe of Arbitrage, short arbitrage advice from successful online resellers and I'm super, super excited about this one. We've got Sylvia on this episode. Uh, Sylvia, I, I, <laughs> super exciting. I actually met Sylvia uh, three years ago this this year at a um, a seminar called uh, the Millionaire Mind Intensive, and we've been good friends since. So I wanted to get Sylvia on. Do you want to give yourself just a a sixty second personal bio, Sylvia? What you've been doing over the last couple of years, taking massive action? Yes, um, I'm Sylvia. I'm in Italian in London. And I've been uh, dreaming about, you know, selling online uh, forever, really, literally forever. I'm like Kev into motivation and like Tony Robbins and coaching and inspiring and motivating everyone. Um, and I'm an events manager. And then I went full time into reselling um, last year in January. And then I started Amazon in August. Now, the first shipment was July. We reached the, the 10K club in the first month and a half uh, with retail arbitrage, no car in London, um, no debt in bank, just savings and hard work. And then we reached uh, £22,000 in gross sales, 45% return, net return on investment in November. Wow, that's amazing. So... That, that's a huge amount of action that you've taken, Sylvia. And I'm, I'm super excited about this episode because, um, you know, you've, you've, you've gone all in with this, which is awesome. And it's the best way to go. So I guess what we'll do is get straight to the questions. And the, th the first question is, how has failure or apparent failure set you up for a later success? Do you have any favorite failure of yours? Oh my God, I have so many because I have been putting myself out of my comfort zone forever, since forever. Um, and I think I've learned a massive lesson, which is the thing that at the beginning seemed to me to be massive failure and, you know, tragedies, then they were the best thing ever happened to me. And you realize later on. So trying to get the life, you know, little by little and don't get overwhelmed thinking, oh my God, what have I done? Uh, which is really difficult at times, but you know, a door closes, a huge one opens for you. So that's my mindset. Yeah, that, I think that's a, that's a, I think that's a great thing to, to I think personally myself, I think like what you've done so you've started your your business, your online business, and you've had incredible success. I mean, you went past ten thousand pounds re revenue in the first like two months, which is amazing. So Thank it's you. about splitting these up. It's about splitting up the 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 big overwhelming task into everyday action. And I think what you've just said there is a, a great bit of advice for people. So what is the what is one of your best or most worthwhile investments? That you've ever made it could be time money or energy you know when when you send me this question because you sent me this question um i realized writing back to you that the the best money i spent and invested were in personal growth so the millionaire mind intensive where we met three years ago that allowed me to start saving and administrate my money realizing what money means for me and that set me free to start my business so that was huge and then UPW London like if you guys um, are a little bit into the Tony Robbins part just get there get there get there this year We're, you're gonna see myself and Kevin there jumping so join us <laughs> yeah yeah I mean um I, I think I think that's I think you know one of the best investments you can make is in yourself and you know I, I know that me and you we both met at the uh, the T Have Acres the Millionaire Mind Intensive which was a great investment and we learned a lot about ourselves and money but um, I think that that's great like if anybody's watching this back if you ever want to get to a seminar like a Tony Robbins seminar 
me and Sylvia definitely recommend it. So um, and we're going to be there. <laughs> and, and we're going to be there. So um, it should be really fun this, this April. So in the last five years then, Sylvia, what new belief, behaviour or habit has most improved your life? Uh, that I multiply my money. So not I don't spend any more my money into little stupid, can I say stupid, stupid yeah, things? Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> just, sorry, I wanted to say crap. Can I say crap? It's a lot of crap. Just, <laughs> I don't spend money. I just think how much money can I take and reinvest? And the belief is that I multiply my money. There is no lack of money. There is no scarcity. There is opportunity everywhere. If you go into any shop, you're going to find something you can flip for profit. Just stop with the scarcity mindset and mentality. That's the main one for uh, me. Yeah, and I love that. And that's and uh, I, that takes me back to the Millionaire Mind Intensive where, again, we were jumping up and down, but we would say that we're a... Um, a money magnet and you have definitely turned into a money magnet you you're walking into stores nowadays Sylvia and you're walking out um more you're richer you've made more money just by doing this so that's awesome the, the, the best part for who is a reseller they can understand us or who wants to be reselling is when I go I went into a shop in September and I had three carts full of toys and Everyone was looking at me like, well, oh, toys. <laughs> and I was like, Christmas is here, mom. Just get your toys now. <laughs> the faces is the funniest part ever. And then the, the fact that you're there, you're spending money, but everyone is looking at you. And I'm like, you are spending money. I am making money. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Um, so, okay, so what what is... What best advice would you give to somebody about to enter this world of reselling online? Just, I think the financial part um, is the most important thing, guys. Like, um, don't play with credit cards like I do, like you have done. <laughs> like, if you don't have the chance to repay in full, the next month I don't know for me the financial part is the most important thing because a lot of us get into online arbitrage and Amazon and eBay to get out of debt to have a side hustle etc just try to take step by step don't go you know I don't know how to say in English you have a way to say don't take the step longer than your leg is it yeah, I mean, and I know exactly what you're saying. I mean, you've got to be uh, a little bit. You've got to be responsible. We've got to say that. I mean, yeah. you know, we w- we don't want we don't want anybody to get into any financial difficulty, and the, you don't want to have this spiral where you go out of control with your credit cards and debt and things. That's obviously not what this yeah. is about. So, however, the thing that I've learned is that scared money don't make money. Just don't go all in in one product or two. Just try to, when you first start, especially, I would say, just try to differentiate a little bit. You know, five year, 10 year, make your researches, get your tools, get a coach if you can, guys. I think a coach, if you pay and you invest in a coach, they're going to save you so much money on stupid mistakes and time, which is money as well. So. Yeah. Which is, I think that's fantastic advice as well. So what, I guess it, that leads into, what are some bad recommendations that you hear relating to this, this the world of arbitrage? Yeah, so who follows follow me on Instagram? Uh, you guys know I've started this uh, welcome to my life, passive income with the sunglasses and the Ferrari everywhere. As you can see, I don't have a Ferrari, guys. Working on it. So I don't have it yet, just here, okay? Not Lamborghini here. But um, the, the, the thing, the joke that I make is that basically it's going to only take you 10 minutes a day to become a millionaire selling on Amazon. That's BS, okay? That is so 
easy and people you're there sleeping and people is making so much money just 10 minutes a day is so easy 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 quick and free does not exist for me uh, I, listen sylvia and i completely completely agree with you in fact anybody that's watching this back and you ever come across anybody saying how easy it is in 10 minutes a day you see the adverts, you see like somebody saying, I've become super, super rich from um, 10 minutes a day. My side yep. hustle now pays for my back. my mansion, my eight bedroom and eight yeah. bathroom. It's just not reality. It takes a lot of hard work. And I know watching you, Sylvia, Sylvia on, on Instagram, your Instagram stories, you're always working. You're always taking huge amounts of action and, and ultimately, <laughs> That's that. That's what it takes, though. You you are committed. So great, great job on you. But can I say? Oh, thank you so much. But can I say something? It's like training, you know, at the gym. You want to lose weight. It's like someone show up one day on your Instagram and tells you it only takes ten minutes a day to become a Victoria's Secret model. Would you believe that? If you believe that, you guys, um, yeah, you have a problem. Can I say that? <laughs> <laughs> you're not gonna become a Victoria's Secret model just training 10 minutes a day for a month exactly same with business, same with business. it gives you freedom and it's really possible if I did it everyone can do it yeah absolutely so uh, okay so the, the the last question here is um when you feel overwhelmed or unfocused or have yeah. lost your focus temporarily, what do you do to, to get back on track to take action? Um, okay, so when um, I have the Mass in Action Plan as a tool, the Massive Action Plan um, designed by Tony Robbins is my main tool to get out of my own head and just prioritize because that's why we get overwhelmed. It's like, I have to do this and I have to do that, but I also have to cook lunch. But I don't, no, just Sylvia, just get it out and then prioritize what is going to make me get to my results as soon as possible. What is really important, not urgent, important to get done. Um, yes, yeah, so this was. What was the question? I think I got lost. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting so excited that I just yeah. know. <laughs> you, you answered it. It was a great, great answer. I mean, I think you hit the nail on the head there. I think, you know, focusing on what's important is the most important thing. I mean, that sounds a little bit crazy, but uh, the, focusing on what's most important is the most important thing. So, a lot of people, you can be busy doing things that are not important. I think yeah. that's what you're trying to say. Like you can get busy and overwhelmed by everybody wanting you to do this and do that. But the truth is like, what's important to Sylvia? Like yeah. what's important to you? And then if you yeah. focus on what's important to you and ultimately that's your goal, your outcome, whatever you want, yeah. then you're, you're completely back focused to what's important to you. And that's the most important thing. So um, sometimes it so, just helps so much. Sorry for interrupting. Just I think it helps so much just to stop what you're doing, get up, drink some water, just breathe, put some music on, just dance like a crazy that my Instagram followers know I do quite often. And then <laughs> just go for a walk and get some fresh air and just, you know, get just start over fresh. Yeah. That's it. And and in and it shows because like how much energy have you got? It's fantastic. So for anybody, for <laughs> anybody watching this, Sylvia, how, where, what is your Instagram? How can people find you on Instagram and how can people join you on your mission of just being highly energetic, jumping around and taking action? I am mainly on Instagram. And the difficult part here is, Kev, is that I, um, I choose a name on Instagram that I can't say in English. So it's Sylvia, <laughs> S-I-L-V-I-A, with the minus, I call it minus under, which is underscore, I think. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> tough few months. Or I think if you put tough few months, you're going to find me and maybe some wild animals. So I'm one of them. <laughs> um, I'm going to put a link in the description below so you can see Sylvia. Yes. I'll put all... I'll put everything that you need to do. Check out Sylvia. She's she's fantastic. Yeah. She's 
She, you see oh, behind the scenes what she's doing, how much action she's taking all the time. Check the, what's this? Can I say something because I didn't sure. say it, and I don't want to think that I am just a, you know, a bargain hunter or um, I don't know. I, if I sh show you my office, it's crazy. This is my eBay inventory. Okay, this is not my closet. Just to <laughs> let you know. Okay, I'm not a shopaholic. I, you, you're a money maker. That's, yes, that's exactly uh, you. Money machine. A money <laughs> machine. I love that. So, listen, thank you so much. If you if you watch to this point, listen to this point, please uh, give Sylvia a, a personal message out on Instagram and say how amazing this interview was. She'd really appreciate it. I would certainly appreciate it. Get all your comments in the description below. Let everybody know how awesome she is. Keep doing what you're doing, Sylvia. I really, really appreciate you coming in today and uh, doing this interview. I know you're Thank very- Thank you. Yeah, love you, Kev. And guys, if you're not following the reselling community in the UK on Instagram, just go and follow up everyone because it's an amazing, positive community and working from home sometimes can be, can, can be lonely. And, you know, I met so many amazing people. Um, it's just come and join the craziness, guys. <laughs> and, and stop buying yeah. crap okay <laughs> invest your money oh, and, and i think on that note it's a really positive note really just to end there thank you guys so much for watching this another episode of tribe of arbitrages she is sylvia she's a tough human we are on to the next time so thank you guys very very much and speak to you guys very very soon ciao, ciao. take care